hello everyone welcome back to my channel today is a very very straightforward video unboxing actually um but before i do that let me tell you a quick story i bought citric acid like the normal citric acid i know is citric acid and as soon as you drop it inside water it kind of gets cool like you know kind of and then at least in 10 15 minutes highest 20 minutes maybe depending on the percentage it has dissolved well your girl here went to buy citric acid and overnight the citric acid was still looking at me i checked the ph it was a ph of about six i had to go back to the vendor because it's someone that i've known for a very long time and for the longest of time i bought things from this guy from this uh, specific vendor i've not really had issues but i noticed like sometime least late last year slash early this year i started having issues to be honest with you like first and foremost i bought um um caustic soda from him and i didn't understand the caustic soda yes i later bought soda ash too i also didn't understand the soda ash i bought mineral oil it was almost like they sold kerosene to me and then just last week i bought citric acid and it wasn't citric acid in <laughs> yeah when i tested it it wasn't even sour as a citric acid should be sour it was even more like salty and it had a ph of about six and that brings me to the reason why i tell um beginner formulators especially the ones that have not really um developed a full-blown relationships with these ingredients to actually be careful when selecting vendors and that's why even me personally i'm careful giving contact of vendors except if that vendor has proved beyond reasonable doubt that they are reliable so i don't just come up on my platform and begin to advertise vendors no 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 i don't do that to be honest with you even my students i don't just give them vendors phone numbers like that i have to really really cross check super check over check <laughs> you know check check before i do that so i'm unboxing um i ordered for some raw materials from a certain vendor and this i said this in front of my camera i just tore it out just now yeah and this vendor is actually based in lagos while i'm based in port Arthur. so obviously i paid for way bill so this is the white beeswax mm -hmm. even though um the yellow beeswax it's better because it um has more of its natural nutrients um intact like mm, yeah it's a, it's actually a process as well but it is not highly processed like the white beeswax yeah so um the white bees beeswax is still not synthetic for like you know due to the cleaning um, um, let's say the polishing process <laughs> you understand but then i use either one i get you understand i use and the irony of the whole thing is that let me even shock you um when you even buy the yellow beeswax when you melt it into your formula it's almost clear like it doesn't really come out yellow yellow i don't know if i'm trying to say to you like it's almost like when it's in a formula you cannot even differentiate between the yellow and the white beeswax so i'm just trying to tell you i'm just trying to elaborate the difference between these two waxes so the next thing i have here is my sodium coquel acetonate powder that is also known as um sci i've never used this before this is my first time drop in the comment section if you're interested in us trying this together yeah like honestly i've always used um other um surfactants yeah um most of the time i use um aos so this is the first time i'm trying this sodium um coca acetonate powder i've never done it so let's keep our fingers crossed like i said if you're interested in us formulating together with this let me know but i'll do it behind the scenes first when i get my results before we come on to but just let me know like encourage your girl these things are expensive these things are worth thousands of naira <laughs> if i convert them to dollar so encourage me i beg because it, i feel good when i come on board and realize that i'm making these videos and someone is out there watching and at least i'm making some coins out of it yeah <laughs> so okay this is another beeswax i ordered from about 200 grams and they come in 100 grams um so basically i think that's it okay i have something here okay this is my zinc oxide like i am a sucker for mineral spfs so i don't know what you no matter what you tell me <laughs> 
about chemical SPFs. I have nothing against it to either, but the mineral, you know, everyone has choices, right? Everyone is allowed to have different choices, their personal choices. So my own personal choice is the mineral um, SPF that contains the titanium dioxide and the zinc oxide. Like, I have gotten even used to the white cast. If people around me have even gotten used to seeing white cast on my face, <laughs> they know it's my SPF. <laughs> so last but not the least is my cocoa glucoside. Yeah, and the fact that these things came all the way from Lagos to Port Harcourt, that is almost more than a thousand kilometers, I think apart or so, I might be wrong, but it's quite far when you're going by road, it should be close to 10, 8 to 10 hours. Like, why am I saying too much? Okay, but the thing is that Lagos to Port Harcourt is far. It's quite a journey, yeah. And these things coming in from such a distance and there is no spillage because this is cocoa glucoside and it's a liquid and there's no spillage at all whatsoever. I am very, very impressed. The packaging is quite cool. You understand? Don't worry with time when I have a very good understanding with these vendors. I can come on board. Yeah, when I have a good understanding with these vendors, I can actually come on board and market do you understand because i don't want to market something today tomorrow you go there and come back and tell me how small this person failed you i'll feel really bad i'll feel disappointed so basically i just had to do a short video on unboxing my raw materials that i ordered all the way from lagos to portacourt and basically that's just it thank you so much please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel like my video share my video drop a comment and tell me where you're watching me from it's important isn't it let's get to know each other more Thank you so much.